Maybe I'm the one on drugs. I truly don't know what I just experienced. Comedians opening cards, no coffee. This is kind of crazy. Comedians opening cards, no coffee. I got someone who was one of the first people who did this. He was an open micer. I met him at, uh, what's that fucking? Strange Brew. Strange Brew. And now he's uh, fucking, uh, fuck, who cares? It's Owen Damon. Damon, and how long have you been doing comedy? Almost three years. Fuck, and I just saw you do, this This place has given us, well, eight minutes. It's already yeah. dropping. It was 10 minutes last week. It's going to be five freaking next week, I'm yeah. sure. So you're now in Chicago. Yeah. And you did this show like a year ago. A year ago. And and the, you said you're doing like eighteen mics a yeah, week. You can, you can hit a lot. You so the improvement that I've seen in one year, he's like a real comic now. And you're what, like twenty? Nineteen. You're nineteen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fuck yeah, yeah. that chick, that young chick yeah, over. Uh, uh, Kate. Kate Kylie. Kylie. Kaylee, Kaylee, these Kaylee. these young comedians, like if you're my age, just stop. Because these fucking nineteen-year-olds fucking are just crushing, and they've what do you have four years under your belt? So I mean, obviously he was probably molested, but you know whatever. We don't have to talk about that. <laughs> so I got all these cards. Uh, you just open a pack. I think I was gonna do. Uh, where where'd the Bob Marley ones go? Bob, Bob Marley's Marley. right here. Oh, right. Bringing back to my reggae phase. And so you're out of school right now. You went to college yeah, for I, a bit. I, I, I did a year. I'm going back to Chicago, and I'm taking it. Taking, we're calling it a gap year. Yeah, I can't, um, I, yeah. like, you stand stoically in one yeah, spot, yeah, yeah. that's a new difference. You freaking so, you hold yeah, the mic yeah. interesting, you hold yeah, it really low. Yeah. I've never seen I, anyone I, do I that. I like to be able to just, like, kind of move Manipulate around. it, because you do the rest yeah, on yeah. the chin kind of yeah, thing, which I see, but the low hold, yeah, I, I, I... I hate when people are up like a rapper. Like that yeah, yeah, yeah. Me. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, I, I like to just kind of have it free. Well, it's interesting because it, like, I was, like... That's not a style I've seen before. So yeah. even mic holding, you have your own style. Yeah. And as a freaking, what'd you say, 19-year-old yeah, fucking, yeah, and you, yeah. just quit. Just quit doing comedy. Okay. So Bob Marley? Bob Marley. Why? I went, I worked at a farm stand in all the other, uh, in Hollis, New Hampshire last summer. Hollis? Hollis, yeah. Where the flea market is? Yeah. That's where I grew up. Well, at the, really? Yeah. Holy shit, I've sold at that flea market, oh, like, I, for years. Really? Yeah, I grew well, yeah. up. Yeah, yeah, I grew up over Did you used to go to that flea market? I've been once or twice. Because it's closed yeah, now. Yeah, the, really? It's gone. Yeah, it's That's over. Crazy. Like, like this is the... Last year was the last year of that Hollis flea market. That's nuts. Yeah. Yeah, no, I grew up there. And I worked at a farm stand, and all the employees... All the other, like, employees were, like, Jamaicans who flew up there and worked over the summer. And oh, so wow. Just, Young? I just hung out. All ages. And I just hung out with these, like, just... Did that help you riffing and stuff? Did I that mean, give you a, a like? Little bit. I can say a few words. Now, but right, but just in general, crazy. like because oh, New Hampshire's yeah. the most freaking like white oh, place, and you had like America. Jamaican freaking yes, people hanging yeah, at a young crazy. age. That's good. Crazy. That's a good experience. Yeah. No, it was, awesome. It was pretty nuts. Yeah yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, so I went through went through a little. Through so a that's the connection to Bob Marley. Oh, wasn't he the best? He's a real comedian, and he's fucking nineteen years old. He's been doing it four years. It's crazy. I know. It's crazy. Yeah. 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 Let's fucking stroke this boy. Yeah, yeah. Not me. Yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah. Right. So what do you got? We got the first one. I guess we got, this is snapshots. Um, Wait, did you purposefully leave Chicago so you weren't there for the uh, no, Democratic this, Convention? This is is that why you're over here? This just He's a Trump guy. <laughs> I don't know. This is just happening. <laughs> I'm sorry. All good. Yeah, this yeah. Is, Red, yeah. black, and green. Oh my oh, God, yeah. the fucking Rasta flag. Oh, I mean, yeah. have you been to Jamaica? Yeah, no. I've never, oh. I've never left the country. I've been to Canada. Okay. It's the closest. Well, you're so young. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. how many how many states have you done comedy in? Uh, Massachusetts, New Hampshire, Illinois. I've done yeah. comedy in more states than you. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Maine. Vermont, New Hampshire, Mass, New York, uh, Ohio, and Kentucky. I've done. Yeah. Fuck yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, there's mics there's everywhere. There's mics everywhere. Everywhere. In New Hampshire, people sleep on Manchester. I think New Hampshire's. We're produced, growing. They, and also, we. I mean, just like historically, you produced Adam Sandler, uh, Sarah Silverman, Sarah Silverman, Seth Meyers. Seth Meyers. And now you got Drew Dunn. Uh, Alec Flynn is a killer. Both of those guys came out of the Laugh Attic. Right. Like, and there's 
I think New Hampshire comedy is super underrated. Of course it is. Yeah. But the also thing that's super cool about being in New Hampshire is in an hour you're at Port oh, yeah. you're in Portland, Maine, yeah. and in an hour you're in Boston fucking oh, yeah. Mass. Yeah, yeah, and in yeah. an hour and change you're in Rhode Island. You can hit all those freaking things. Yeah, you can go to uh, and, and uh, Worcester, Mass. Has my, there's mics. I, I, I did a lot. Uh, I was lived 30 minutes away from Lowell and 30 from Manchester. So I was, I was oh. a Lowell guy for a while. Right. So you've been doing it four years. You were here for two or three. Yeah. And then Chicago and then with school Chicago and shit. Last year, spent a year there. And I mean, that's Chicago is the best place in the country to get good. I feel How like did they turn the river to go the opposite way? That's the question everyone's asking. What do you mean? The river that runs through Chicago oh, in like no the idea. '60s, they flip the direction. Really? It, yeah, it used to. Let's pretend. I don't know which way wait, it goes wait, now. Wait, wait, wait. Does it go into the river? Now? Well, that's what I don't know. Into the lake? I don't know. That's Whatever insane. way it goes, at some point they switch the direction that's crazy. somehow. All I know is they dye it green. Right? Yes, for for freaking what's it called? Was, for and, St. Patty's Day, I was hanging. yeah. Chicago, and have you seen the cow? They have the cow in that thing. There's like a cow representing the cow that burned down the city. Really? Yes, it's in the. Oh, it's in that. that it's on the like. It's by the. It's by the. It's by the the, the lake, yeah, yeah. and you could. There's like that bike trail, running trail, yeah. and whatever the whatever side, and there's a fucking little thing, and there's the fucking O'Leary's cow. Yeah. I mean, it's like it's obviously not the cow's dead. I think it was burned, but that's fun. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Chicago's great. I, I love Louis Chicago. Sullivan, the, his, the the birth of the skyscraper, because that fire burned the buildings down. Oh, yeah. And that's when, because Otis had just gotten the elevator patent. Yeah. So they were, a, uh, they were a city gonna build a new, so that elevator got them, and Louis Sullivan built the first skyscrapers because of that. No one cares. Ah, oh, comedy is not my freaking. Oh, good. Yes. We can go through more cards. That's this is a lyric card, Bob Marley. I think we're seeing a theme here. Mm. Are there are there are there stuff on both sides or oh full th oh my god what, yeah, what? These are sick. wait this has a border this had no border on it is there dope on the other side oh, this is, these are is awesome. this weed oh it look they, they look like weed lions this is <laughs> it totally looks like dope. dope this is fantastic it is dope I used to get paid in weed at the very much at as a seventeen year old. Wow! Oh, no, yeah, uh, the old uh, the guy who used to host it would pay me to host the second half of the mic, and he'd give me an eighth of weed every Wednesday. And I was a seventeen year old. Like this is the greatest thing ever. Holy shit! Who is the guy? Oh, it was a mu it was probably a music thing. There was a guy back in the day who told me, um, oh fuck, maybe it was a comedian. Anyway. They went, they went, they went to get paid. It was probably a comedian thing. It probably wasn't telling me. It was probably a thing I heard on a podcast. But there was a guy fucking, after the thing, it was like, oh, you would go to the, they had a, um, um, uh, junkyard and they grew pot in the old cars. So it just looked like a junkyard. So after the show, you went and you would just go pick out all this dope right from the fucking old car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't remember what state. It was something in the South or something. But they got you got to be very careful in the South for dope. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you do all the cards? Yeah, I don't I know what we got. Cards, yeah. This is a weird... I have more. A lot of, uh, That's a classic and with those fucking of, dreads. Yeah, and then there's a lot of history on the back. Mm. These, are, these are sick. Yeah, this, is, this one's Bob on tour with some old facts on the back. Wow, and you get to keep all but one. Oh, what is this weird... Oh, it's oh, a checklist. Oh, this is a collector, so you can collect all... Now, in baseball cards, oftentimes that checklist becomes a very valuable card because kids drew on them and checked them off and didn't care, so it becomes a harder card to get than, yeah. I mean, it's good. Like, a Derek Jeter first is going to be better, but the checklist back in the day, that becomes a valuable card because people didn't care, and a completist wanted. Oh, this, yeah, this is... This is a we got a book? You got a book? What? This is you got a little, oh, you, can, you can't buy that merch anymore, though. But it's probably all more valuable. Yeah. Like, try to find the most, what's yeah, the, yeah. the hat, the jersey? Yeah, you can oh, get my a, God. You can get a Bob Marley jersey. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's you can't, that, not for those prices, not though. Anymore. Yeah, that's all on eBay. It's way more expensive. Oh, yeah. I think, I think we're to the back. I think we just went through you, you totally were the funniest person tonight. Thank you. Don't you think? Yeah. I, I mean, you must think that. Oh, yeah. I mean, you're so professional. It's, it's unbelievable. Yeah, it's, that, the, the, the amount of, that time, it's just, it's just amount of time it's on mic. I did in three, uh, what was it? 
In two and a half years, I did 500 sets. Mm, yeah. And you, like, I heard some of this stuff the other night when yeah, I saw yeah, you yeah. again. Uh, just, I'm also just warming up from coming back from Alaska. Like, no, of course. So I'm at, like, just made my seventh set back after two months. Right. Before. That's what I was but wondering is how many times you've done some of the jokes that I heard. This is probably six or seven. So I'm just, I'm just warming back up. Right. Just getting back into it now. Go back out to Chicago in September 1st. So what do you, a few of the comedians on the podcast, the big boys, are saying that they're starting to see that that peak is happening. Yeah. What do you think? The, the peak of comedy as a whole? Yeah. I don't think it's, I don't think the peak's in I don't think it's, it's, it's just been growing. It's been growing for yeah. since the 90s. I don't think it's peaking. I'm imagining that some of those bigger players are jumping too quick from, say, like theaters to th or whatever, and then they're they're like, oh, we jumped too quick, and they're having some trouble selling all those things. But all the open, all the other mics are just growing. It's growing. I talk about sometimes, like being a 19 year old comic and starting when I was in junior high school. I talk about all the time is like the best comics of my generation have not started saying. If you think about the best comics of yeah. my generation have never picked up a microphone. Well, it depends what you how you're defining your generation. Gen of like, That's a of like, I'm like middle of Gen Z. There's there's only a few Gen Z guys who are really like. You think like, someone then that starts after you is going to be better? I mean, there were people like older. If you name your favorite comic, there's guys who are older than him and guys who are younger than him. You, you kind of come through in classes, right? I mean, if you think the best person. Who's I don't know, probably like if there's a guy five who's eventually in twenty years he's gonna be five years younger than me, who's gonna be a killer. Yeah, 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 yeah. He, yeah, hasn't, yeah. he hasn't even picked up or even thought about saying yet. I think that's why I think when it, like peaking is yeah. gonna happen. I yeah. Think it's just, we're just keeping the economy just growing. Yeah. There's this whole global warming thing though that yeah, could no, ruin no, it all. Yeah, yeah, Miami might sink. New York's good though. No, Miami's totally going <laughs> yeah, down. Yeah. New York's fucked yeah, yeah. too. All the all the oh, yeah. freaking things. Dude, Chicago's you could... never sinking. We're on a well, lake. there's weird things with the. I mean, there's weird things with the lakes too because that fluctuates. It all yeah. depends on where you're getting your clean water. It's all about clean water, yeah, really. Hundred percent. Yeah. Ha 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 ha. Hundred percent. All right. Yeah. Okay. Manchester, you... New Hampshire's never sinking. Oh fuck no. We had the first outbreak of um. Um, no, the mill had um, anthrax. Really? The first breakout of anthrax in America was at one of the mills in New Hampshire, and they leveled the thing and got rid of whatever. That's crazy. Yeah, because of, we had all the fucking uh, fabric shit. Okay, just Fuck sign it. one for me I'll and keep the others if you so desire. Freaking A. You know, I'm so happy to have... It's really fun yeah. for me to... One, I was so happy so to see fun. you the other yeah, night yeah, at uh, yeah. uh, uh, seven uh, Bar 17 beer uh, place with a... Whatever, but then I was like, "Fuck! I hope I see you at least one more time yeah. because I'm not on any of that social shit." Um, because I really wanted to have just to talk to you a little bit about freaking the changes and stuff, and it's just about hitting those mics and getting comfortable on stage and not worrying about uh, you know. Owen Damon. Not that I mean, Owen crushed Owen Damon it. Damon on a Bob Marley card. How cool is that? Look identical. Well, yeah, I mean, uh, you know, pants down. Oh, ha -ha -ha. oh you know. <laughs> Go see live comedy because that's where it's happening. Okay, Thank thanks, so Dave. Much. You don't want a picture? Okay. Well, it's all.